Hey, what is good, A team? It's your boy T. Now, hey, man, today we are back with another food review. Hey, bro, it's been a minute since we have knocked out a food review on the channel. Um, definitely the first one that we've knocked out in the whip. It's the first time in the car actually doing it. Normally, we at the crib. Um, can tell from the from the title, we stopped that wing stop. Now they dropped a new chicken sandwich. Supposedly you can get this tossed in any sauce, any flavor. Now me personally, when I come to Wingstop, which I don't come too often, but when I do, I normally get that all in wing bundle. For whatever reason, I don't like regular wings from, or I, I just don't ever really order regular wings from Wingstop. I don't know why. I normally get tenders, boneless, and some fries, call it a day. Might be because I got the most value for me, but either way. Like I said, you can get this new chicken sandwich tossed in any sauce. Um, and I want to say they had this out as like a limited time product or it was maybe in like test markets a couple months back. Um, but I believe they just dropped it like nationwide today or like a maybe a day or two ago. But either way, as y'all see, regular old wing side box, nothing too crazy. I got mine tossed in garlic parm. Garlic parm is actually my favorite sauce from Wingstop, hands down. For whatever reason, I don't like their like wet sauces, like the honey barbecue stuff like that is cool, but that's just regular. It's just okay to me. Garlic parm and the Louisiana rub or, um, oh, it's another one, Old Bay. That's probably what I should have got, but I don't think they had the actual option online. Only thing is, stuffies. All that extra on top, bro, I need, uh, this should be good though, you feel me? Now, I don't know if, they, I don't think this is a fresh chicken sandwich, like it's hand breaded or nothing like that. Um, I did get some ranch to go with it. Bro, this is just too bright in here today, you feel me? What's going on here? Auto focus acting crazy? Hey man, it is what it is. But I got some ranch to go with it. We are gonna try it without the ranch, of course, just to see what it's talking about. Like I said, I don't know if this is fresh, if it's hand, not fresh, but if it's like a frozen type of chicken patty and they just fry it, I don't know for sure, but we gonna find out. It's a nice little thickness to it. Not the thickest, KFC honestly is my favorite chicken sandwich right now. Better than Popeyes to me. I've never been the biggest fan of Chick-fil-A for whatever reason, their flavor is nice, but I've just never really been the hugest fan of it. Let's see what it's talking about. I'm going to keep it a thousand with you. This is, in all honesty, this is a chicken tender on a bun. With this garlic parm flavor, it reminds me exactly of their chicken, I mean, of, yeah, of the chicken tenders when it's in garlic parm. I don't know what it is. Chicken is so, just so y'all can see it. Hold on. bring that down some for y'all yeah i mean you got a couple fibers up in there nothing extremely crazy i do need to try with the ranch with the ranch i know for a fact it's gonna take it up and, the, and and i was i was already thinking about getting me two kfc chicken sandwiches tonight but since i'm stopping to try this i don't know if i'm gonna do it bro I, last night side note hey First of all, I'm gonna give y'all some sauce on how to get a free chicken sandwich. I don't know if I mentioned that at the beginning. Should have been in the title. I'll throw it up on the screen over here, but Wingstop supposedly is giving out 100,000 free sandwiches. Um, I'll leave the link in the description for y'all to go to the actual website. Literally, it's like you gotta sign some breakup letter to your favorite chicken sandwich spot. That Like they got KFC, Popeyes, Hardee's, like, three, four other places on there. And once you sign it, like it'll direct you to Wingstop site with a little code and it'll text you the code to your phone and all that. One thing I'm mad about is the fact that I didn't figure that out till after I ordered this sandwich. Imagine that. Mm -hmm. 
Nothing to drink in here, bro. This is pretty good, though. I'm not going to lie. Now, my thing is, it's not really... I wouldn't necessarily put this over any other chicken sandwich like that. Like, it can compete, I guess. But would I just say, oh, I'm going to go and grab a wing? Now, one of the only reasons I would say maybe you would want to go to Wingstop over any other place is because you can get the sauces on there. And I meant... First of all, I didn't ask for no pickles. I kept pickles on there, but there's no pickles on here. I put no pickles on my sandwich. What are y'all doing? Pickles, I feel like would have added something to it. I like pickles on my chicken sandwich, coach. And I seen somebody else do a review where they said they didn't have pickles either, so. Mm. My chicken sandwich is like five fifty nine. What am I gonna come up to? They did not give me a receipt, but hold on real quick. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Came up to six fifteen total after tax. That's why I say it's not necessarily. Like, it's not bad where you're like, oh, no, nah, I like, I wouldn't eat it. To me, I feel like they're going to win with this a little bit because of the sauces. Because you can add your favorite Wingstop sauce to the sandwich. Stone and the ranch comes with it. And the ranch takes it up a notch, you feel me? Um, I think they have a meal as well that's like maybe $7, something like that, or around there. I'm not sure exactly how much it is. Um... But to me, I would still get a KFC sandwich over this to keep it a buck. To me, if this sandwich was a dollar cheaper than the others, that would be the incentive for me to come here versus somewhere else. Because it's a comparable chicken sandwich, but you also get the sauce and the dip. The ranch sauce. Some people might not care about ranch sauce or blue cheese to dip their stuff in, so that might not matter. Some people might not care about the flavors on there, so that might not matter. So they would say, hey, I'm going to just stick with my Popeyes or my KFC. Or I'm going to go to those places and just get my favorite sauce from there and shake it in there. I mean, hey, to me, like I said, it's a cool chicken sandwich. I wouldn't say it disappoints. And shout out to my little brother, Jazz. He said this seems long overdue. Like Wingstop without a chicken sandwich. They're a chicken spot. And you had all these places doing chicken sandwiches and all this. Of course, they tested this in a test market like two, three months ago. But it seemed like they should have been one of the first ones to be in a chicken sandwich, to be honest, would you? Oh. <laughs> they ain't give me no napkins or nothing. Come with your own napkins, my boy. But yeah, with this ranch, with this garlic parm, this is hitting to me. I would like to try it with another flavor as well, just to see what it's talking about. Like, I've never tried Wingstop's mild sauce. I think I've tried their barbecue before. Um, the Old Bay, I've tried the Louisiana rub. This is a quality chicken sandwich. Now, for the ones, <clears throat> for the ones who can't get this or who just don't want to try it for whatever the reason is, or don't want to pay for it, rather, use that free uh, coupon today. When you see this video, click on the link in the description. Go get your free sandwich if you want to try it, but you ain't trying to pay for it. That's all I got to say. Like I said, the garlic parm is hitting. I would like to try another flavor. I might come back and drop another video if y'all want to see it. If y'all want to see me do like ring stop sandwich versus somewhere else, 
just let me know. I might come with that since I do have a coupon for a free sandwich now, even though I had to pay for this. So y'all let me know if enough of y'all say it, I'll come with a another review, either just of a different flavor or do a wing stop versus somebody else chicken sandwich. I don't know. That ain't bad, no brother. That garlic parm has to. Uh, That garlic parm is tough. Mm. That's not gone. Either way, man, my battery about to die on my camera. As y'all can see, we back with the food reviews, or at least temporarily. We'll be knocking out some more. I wanted to do a review to this piece I got the other night, garlic parm, chicken, bacon, ranch pizza from Domino's. That thing was hidden. I missed the Little Caesars uh, New World Fanceroni pizza with the cup pepperonis. I missed doing a review on that, but I did taste it. That's tough. I've been I've been missing out on the food reviews, bro. But I, if you're here still still watching, I appreciate you tuning in with your boy. Drop a like. Drop a comment. Let me know what else y'all want to see next. If you've tried this sandwich out, let me know what y'all think and y'all favorite flavors of the sandwich. Let me know if y'all rocking with it. Has it been long overdue since Wingstop needed a chicken sandwich on the menu? Y'all let your boy know. Like I said, I ain't got too much else to say, man. On the road to 25K subscribers, 18. Appreciate all the love y'all been showing so far. Let's keep it going. Keep it growing. Like I always say, y'all keep coming back, tuning in. I'm going to keep these videos rolling out. We're going to keep getting it lit over here. Catch y'all on the next video.